We're here in Houston for this matchup between the Texans and the Dolphins. Which team can get the longer returns in the return game? And also, what has stopped the, or what can always be a problem in games like this is penalties. Try to keep them to a minimum. We'll see how it turns out. His stock is on the rise at quarterback, Matt Moore. Matt Moore did a tremendous job for the Miami Dolphins last year. Came in, threw the football well, moved around, led his team to some victories. First down here. Five-step drop. And he makes the catch just past the first down marker. Confidence, it's an unbelievable thing, isn't it? When you get that first first down in the game, it gives you a little confidence, but maybe most importantly, it gives your coach confidence. They load it up now, bring out the jumbo formation. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. Gains may be fine. Here's the offensive line, which must protect its quarterback today. will go with the extra tonnage here with the jumbo set and he wants to throw it across the middle when you're a quarterback throwing against zone defenses look for the open space that's what he did that time he found it and the receiver ran in there and made the catch The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Working that left side. Gets a hand on that one to knock it away. Here are the starters today on defense. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Dolphins now move the chains. What a job by the quarterback, finding a way to throw that football and pick up another first down. They are marching down the field right now. Offense lines up here. Back to the air here on first down. He'll fire it out to the left, right where it had to be. Good job getting the first down by the offense. And look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering there. Teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. Play number six coming up on this drive. Now in rhythm, the quarterback. That's an interception. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. The man who directs the Texans' attack, quarterback Matt Schaub. If Matt Schaub would have stayed healthy and was able to finish the year out and go into playoffs, I really believe the Houston Texans would have been in the Super Bowl. Here, a split backfield. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. And he's taken down. You're talking about a bonus. When you get a defensive tackle that can get in the backfield and sack the quarterback, that is something special. Great job that time by the big D tackle. Offense lines up here. Foster taking it up the middle. There's a flag out. 
the defense will not decline. They will take the penalty. Offense costing themselves there. Second down following the penalty. And that's a gain of 10. When you look at the Houston Texans on offense, you can't help but take note, first off, of Arian Foster. Uh, he's the big smooth. I mean, Arian Foster is one of those guys you watch him run, you go, man, that was 10 yards? Because he makes it look so easy. He is one of the best in the NFL, and it's about time he gets recognized. Wide open for the catch. Good job by the receiver that time. Get that extra couple yards, gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Now first and ten. A tackle behind the line. And here's a look at the defensive unit that'll be looking to halt this offense today. Fifteen minutes down, 45 minutes to go. And we'll return after this message and a word from your local station. Two tights for this play. Second and 12. Back to the ground. They knocked him down behind the line of scrimmage. Play number six coming up on this drive. From the gun. Throwing now to his left. He's got the grab, and he's got the first. This offense, they are methodical, aren't they? It's kind of boring to watch. First down, first down, first down. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. First down and ten. Here's the handoff to Arian Foster. He falls out. Hold on a minute. There's an injured player on the field. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field. And my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no doubt about it. That makes everybody nervous. Nice. Second down and two. Going to lose yards here. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. Third and five. Matt Schaub looking wrong. That pass incomplete. Should be a routine punt. <laughs> Dolphins come on to the field for their next series. The offense pinned back in an awful position. Looking across the middle, swatted away. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. Extra DBs all over the field. They'll go shotgun here. 
knocked down. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. Now looking at third down. Quarterback drops back, looking to the right side and throwing. Here's the pass, and it's broken up incomplete. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position, nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football, and it leads to another incomplete pass. This punt will be returned. Seven yard gain on the play. Great starting position here for the offense. First and ten. The give to the running back. He's got some daylight. Shove to the sideline. Well, when you get down here this close, you've got to be tough, big, and strong to get in the end zone. That time, he falls a couple inches short. lining up here after picking up more than 30 on the previous play. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. And now we reach the two-minute warning here in the second quarter. From inside the red zone. Quarterback tosses it to the outside. They tackle him for a loss. The quarterback stands alone in the backfield. Snap back to the quarterback, out of the gun. The pass had to be perfect. If I'm on the defense and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that it is a run. If they have the courage to throw it, let them. If they do, of course it'll be a touchdown. A short field goal try on the way. Well, Jim, that field goal puts them in the lead. It was a nice drive by the offense. And what it does, it just gives you confidence. You did some positive things on the field, and it should carry over for you for the rest of the game. The Dolphins are back deep, waiting for the kick return. He stacked up at that point. It's first down as they head to the line. Quarterback dropping back, and he's intercepted. Not giving up another inch. Good job by the defensive back. Reading the wide receiver, makes the break at the perfect time, and gets the interception.
Offense now in the red zone. Out of the shotgun formation. Scanning the field. Looks to his left. Got a hand on it, and it's incomplete. Terrible job by the offensive line. Your quarterback needs more time than that. Uh, another incompletion. Second down after the incompletion. Takes the stab from the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left. He's locked from Houston. Across for the touchdown. It's commonplace now. It's hard to even say the word great for a catch by the wide receiver. We see so many of them. But this one, that is a great catch. The Texans for the extra point. Add the extra point. The kick is good. The Dolphins are back deep, waiting to return the kick. Breaks another. Tackles made. The safety near the line of scrimmage. First and ten. Inhales the pass. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down. Keep those chains moving. Give yourself three more opportunities. One more snap in halftime. That does it for the first half. Dolphins trail on this one.